Hi everybody, my name is Kevin Bridge. Welcome to my YouTube channel. And today I'm going to show you three positions that you should try to do in your own time if you want to improve your yoga practice, if you are an absolute beginner and been considering to take up yoga on a regular basis. Okay, three positions. The first position, instead of sitting conventionally in a chair, Lose that and start to sit cross-legged on a cushion, either on the floor or on your sofa. When you're sitting down, maybe watching TV, maybe even eating a meal. Now, if you sit cross-legged and you find that your knees are raising quite high in this position, even on one cushion, what you do, you add more cushions. So, your hips and knees at least level or your hips are slightly higher and the reason why I say to sit cross-legged because what this does is help your hips to externally rotate more it helps to stretch your groin because many of us are tired before we take up yoga and also release the pressure off your lower back so you can learn to sit upright so if you have a problem sitting upright this is a very good thing to do. As your hips start to get open and the back muscles start to get a bit stronger, you can sit in this position with a pillowcase behind your back and that will start to let you get used to sitting straight comfortably. That's position number one. Position number two is simpler. Start to or learn to kneel. Go on your knees. Point your toes, sit back on your heels with your knees together. Now why I say this? Because in this position, you get flexibility in the ankles. You help to eradicate slowly flat-footedness. So the foot is up the arch, the inner arch. And also, you stretch your four quadriceps and hip flexor. At first, this might be very challenging. So, as you work towards kneeling, again, what you do is get a cushion and you put the cushion behind the back of your knee and you sit on the cushion so it keeps you higher up. And you find that challenging, you place more than one cushion behind. And what you try to do, you try to hold this for about 30 seconds until you start to get comfortable. And then when you can hold it for several minutes, you take away the layers of cushion you're actually sitting back on your heels. The third and final position is the squat and the sumo wrestler position. Now what this does is really get flexibility in the ankles. It helps your hips to again externally rotate. It stretches the groin and it's really healthy for your knees and it strengthens your legs. So if you can sit in this position comfortably for several minutes, yeah, you develop the strength in the legs, the flexibility in your ankles and it develops your knees to become healthy and strong, especially when you stand up from this position. Okay? So these are three things I recommend that you start to incorporate in your daily life. If you are an absolute beginner and starting yoga, and even if you're not and you find these positions challenging to do, I recommend that you do these regular and as they become easy, you're going to find a difference it's going to make to your posture, to your practice. I hope you found that helpful. My name is Kevin Bridge. Please subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to click the like button and remember,